Oh, I'm gonna murder. We want some. Oh, I see the red dots. It's happening. It's happening. Catch him by surprise. Oh, hey. He just stood there like an idiot. Shit. Shit. These husks are incredibly annoying. Because they just explode on you. Oh my god. The no scope was not happening. Grenades. But I never seem to have them when I need them. The sniper is powerful. Ah, yes. The loot goblin. Oh, there's more. Oh, they heard. They got my message. Just doing a little deleting. No different than cleaning out your desktop. You just, you know, go through, move the clicker, put it on top of something, click it and delete it. Same thing. Yeah. We spent that 300,000 on the sniper rifle and then turned around and, oh. What is up, dudes? I thought you... They're so thoughtful. Oh. I see you hiding back there. You gotta say, guys, that was fucking clean. Seven shots, seven kills. That was an uncomfortable rattle. There's something in here. Oh, hey, what up? How come my shots aren't hitting? Get down. Man, fuck those. Look at those crawling guys. Oh, what's up, dude? As the last geth falls, you hear music from across the room. On the monitor, a quarian stands before a hushed crowd, warbling a mournful a cappella of worlds of worlds and innocence lost. The recorded song is dispatched to the geth worlds behind the Perseus Veil. The transmitter shuts down. I don't know what that fucking means. Perimeter clear. Shepard, I need to talk to you. It's important. Is something wrong? You know the data you took from those Geth control nodes? The information you uploaded to Alliance Control? I want a copy of it. 
You want to bring this data back to the migrant fleet? Those files have information that could be vital to our efforts to understand the Geth. It could be the key to helping us reclaim our homeworld. If I give you this data, your pilgrimage is over. You'll go back to your own people. Not right away. I'll stay with you as long as it takes to stop Seren. But my people need this. You think you can use this information to destroy your enemy? Not right away. We will need to study it. It could take years. But it will give us new insight into how the Geth have changed and evolved over the past centuries. Go ahead. Make a copy. My people... Yeah, no brainer. The council's gonna hate that. Council's gonna hate that, but I don't care. The only thing I can offer I don't even give a shit. Is what you already Fuck them. Have. My solemn promise to stay with you until Saren and his Geth armies are defeated. I never wanted anything more. Thank you, Shepard. That's not true. I definitely wanted more than that. Yeah, what can they do? Fire me? I will topple their whole government. Hey, a girl. I get the feeling you want to ask me something, Commander. Maybe we could pick up where we left off. You were telling me about your interest in the Protheans. Actually, I think I was talking about my interest in you and making a fool of myself in the process. As I said, I am not used to dealing with people, especially humans. I did not really know much about your species when we first met, Shepard. I found it hard to take humanity seriously. Your kind always seemed so rushed and high-strung. We don't have the luxury of time, and the Sari can live for a thousand years. We're lucky if we hit 150. That is true. At first I Damn, thought that 150? was a species. After spending time with you and your crew, however, I think it may actually be an advantage. You humans are creatures of action. You pursue your goals with an almost indomitable determination. It is an admirable trait, but also an intimidating one. You're scared of us? Unfortunately, the rest of the galaxy sees humanity as something of a bully. You to understand what made you into the man you are. Man, she interested. There is something compelling about you, Shepard. Are you sure you're interested in me? Or is it my visions of the Protheans? I admit, your connection to the Protheans had something to do with my initial interest. But it has grown beyond that. You intrigue me, Shepard. But I was not sure if it was appropriate to act on my feelings. I wasn't sure if... Are you interested in me, Shepard? No, you were right. There is something between us. I knew it, and I knew you felt it too. But does this not seem rather strange? Why do I feel so close to you? Because I'm him, we baby. We've <laughs> known each other a short time. We are from two different species. We have almost nothing in common. This makes no sense. These things never make sense. They just happen, and we get swept up in the storm. You make it sound so chaotic, so dangerous. Poggers, poggers, poggers. I'll keep you safe. I am not looking for a protector. This is all a bit overwhelming. I am not used to. Oh, did I say the wrong thing? No. I need some time. She down bad, says yours. <laughs> Take all the time you need, Liara. I'll be here. Thank you, Shepard. Let's... Let's just talk about something else for now. Something else? What do you mean? I should go. Goodbye, Shepard. I got an alien crushing on me. I got an alien crushing on me. All right, rogue, rogue, v, rogue, virtual intelligence. What do you got for me, dog? What do you got for me? I know what I got. I've got explosive rounds, and I want to see what they do. Oh, 
Of course, I missed the first shot. They do a lot of damage. These things move a lot, though. That's annoying. a lot of damage they're doing a lot of damage i guess i just gotta dest destroy these toxic gas is being oh i probably shouldn't have done that huh now it gets fun At least my overheating ends real like it goes away pretty fucking quick because of that uh because of, of that other mod that i have on. the lights on the optical mainframes flicker and die the first of the three computing clusters containing the vi is offline Been pretty good about keeping up with the side quests so like short of actually like just running around and finding planets to fuck with They sure do love walking right in front of my, right in my sights. Like, oh, Shepard's getting ready to fire off into the head of my enemy. Better run back in front of his gun. Kinetic barrier fields powered up throughout the bunker complex. I don't know what that means. Oh. Good thing I one hit barriers. Charging up. That's number two. On to number three. secured so if you go by the main quest maybe just this session if you just do straight main quest i'm not sure how much of the side quest you'll do if you do the small insignias that will take a while okay if i had to guess it'll probably be wednesday then so let's prepare for that, potentially. Because we'll have to do a wheel spin. Additional security drones. All I can't do is just like on the barrier. Stupid idiots. How long? I think we're done. 
A burst of white, nor white noise over all frequencies nearly deafens you. Your hard suit heads up display interprets as a series of zeros and ones. They repeat again and again, blanketing all frequencies until the lights on the final VR cluster flicker and die. Specialization class achieved. What? Their specialization class will replace your base class in the talents on the squad screen. Talent ranks in your base class transfer over to your specialization class. Go to your squad screen to view the bonuses you gain with each rank. Oh, I got to choose one. Oh, that's like a no-brainer, right? Improves assassination, increased damage with all weapons. Yeah, that's the move. 100%. Overload and sabotage? Fuck that. I almost never use those. Yeah, commando. Yo, sick. Message coming in. Patching it through. Normandy, this is Alliance Command. We're detecting your presence in the Attican Beta Cluster. One of our surveillance drones was gathering intel on Geth activities in the region when it was spotted and shot down. You need to go ground side and recover the drone's data module before the Geth find it. Okay. You mean the Cerberus quest or the nuke one? That's the one you would do before? Think anything of this here? Or? This is probably for a quest. And I'm like, I shouldn't be here yet. Search monkey? <laughs> oh, the Geth? You want some? Damn. We've been flanked. I guess this guy. No, maybe. I'm waiting. Congratulations on becoming the first human Spectre commander. I'm certain you'll be up to the challenge. I appreciate that. My name is Admiral Kahoku. It's about time the Alliance got one of our own in with the Spectres. We need people like you to deal with our problems. Is something wrong, Admiral? I'm getting stonewalled by bureaucratic assholes. <laughs> Nothing new. Maybe you can help me, Shepard. One of my recon teams was investigating some strange activity out in the Traverse. We lost contact yesterday. Now I can't get clearance to check it out. Suddenly it's a restricted area. But that doesn't apply to you, Shepard. Spectres can go anywhere they want. You could find out why my team dropped out of contact. I'll find them, Admiral. I appreciate that, Commander. I was running out of options. Lucky for this I'm guy, Spectre happened to come by. I'm going to see if I can by. find anything out through official channels. Won't hold my breath, though.
and I ate that. Homie's got aimbot, dude. Tentacles. Loser. Hell yeah. Well, I guess that explains what happened to the fucking Marines, eh? Alliance soldiers. Looks like they were lured here by the distress beacon. It appears these men were under the command of Admiral Kahoku. He will want to know what happened here. Yes, he will. I'm waiting. Commander, any word on my missing men? I'm not sure how to tell you this, Admiral. Your men were killed by a thresher maw. A thresher maw? That's not... My men wouldn't just stumble into a thresher nest. Not the entire unit. Somebody lured them there with an Alliance distress beacon. Placed it perfectly so they'd land right beside the thresher nest. Damn it. Yeah, I saw the announcement feeling about this that uh, just Jesus mentioned it, but I feel like Chairman Burns is uh, bait. My unit somebody I would. And nobody seems to know anything. I feel like I've about heard that name, but Commander, maybe I'm just imagining it. Did. Now I need to do my part. The families of those Marines deserve to know why they died. Anything you need from me? Not right now, Shepard, but I'll let you know as soon as I find something out. Oh, Emily Wong. I know you. Hey, Commander Shepard. Hello again, Commander. I've got a proposition for you. Since you helped me get information on the crime syndicate, I've gotten a lot more backing from my publishers. I'm investigating traffic controller conditions now, and I wondered if you could help. That seems like a step down from wide-scale corruption. Actually, in a way, it's more important. This isn't about people getting rich. This is about safety. I've heard rumors that the space traffic controllers are overworked to a dangerous degree. I can't get into the control room, but you could. If you planted a bug inside, I could crack the story. If you crack this story, what's likely to happen? Ideally, there will be calls to improve working conditions by hiring more controllers and upgrading systems. The Council won't pay for improvements voluntarily. This story will provide that pressure. This bug you want me to plant, could it interfere with traffic signals? Absolutely not. I made certain that the frequencies it uses won't interfere with anything. What will this bug allow you to pick up? Just audio and video. I'm not trying to tap into the traffic control system if that's what you're worried about. I just need to hear and see them in order to correlate their activity with traffic efficiency. Everyone knows space traffic controllers are overworked. How is this news? 
There's a difference between overworked and dangerous. Traffic at the Citadel has increased by 300% in the last century, but traffic controller resources haven't kept up. We already have several last-minute wave-offs per week. Do we have to wait for a full-blown disaster? I can't promise anything, but I'll see what I can do. Give me the bug. Yeah, sure. Excellent. Just place it on a terminal with a good view of the area. Thanks again for your help. In the long run, this story is going to save lives. Mass Effect 3. It'll fucking have something. <laughs>